there, Panthers. I'm Eric. And I'm Lorna. And we have a packed episode of GSTV for you today. We have everything from chorus to PSSA tips and even an extreme interview. I wonder what that is. Before we get to these news, please keep, keep in mind these upcoming dates. The resource students will be showing off their projects on Museum Night, April 9th. Up first, we have Ian Notch interviewing Mrs. Waverly about our chorus program. TV with Aiden and Ariana. So guys, why'd you pick the chorus program out of all the other music programs here at Wooden Square? And I sung a lot at like family parties, so I chose chorus. I picked chorus because um, I'm good at singing and I like to sing a lot. Uh, how long have you guys been in the chorus program? Uh, I've been in chorus for three years. Same. Hey. Uh, do you like Miss? Waverly as like a director. I think she's a very good director. <laughs> Hello, Miss Waverly. Hello, Lunch. Who inspired you to uh, be a music teacher? I think the two most important people who inspired me were my high school choral director, Mr. Lechner, and my piano teacher, Mrs. Heisler. They both um, not only supported me with my piano and my singing, but they also helped me choose a college. I went to Westchester, which is a great school to become a music teacher, and, um, and, and I got my music degree there. And then I went to Kutztown University and got my master's degree in education. For all our viewers out there that want to join chorus, could you tell us a little bit more about your music program? Of course. If to be in the chorus, all you have to do is like to sing. And you can join when you're in fourth grade, fifth grade, or sixth grade. You can be in for one year, or you can be in for all three years. I've heard that there's a select group of students here. What's that all about? Yes, there is. Um, I decided about 10 years ago to start a select chorus because I have so many wonderful singers here. So um, to be in the select chorus, you already have to be in my big chorus in fourth, fifth, or sixth grade. You have to audition. The number varies. Some years I have 30 kids in. This year I have 43 because there are so many exceptional singers at Gwinnett Square. This year we have 96 in chorus, and that number again varies depending on the year, but it's usually between 80 and 100. This is GSTV. Back to you. I am so impressed with all the talent we have here at the square. Yeah, maybe one of them will even be on The Voice someday. Now to Peter and Matthew for a new segment called Survey Says. Hi, my name is Peter. And I'm Matthew. The survey question of the week is, what do you like better, chocolate or vanilla ice cream? Vanilla! Vanilla. 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 Chocolate. My favorite is vanilla. Vanilla. Chocolate. Chocolate. Vanilla. 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 Definitely chocolate. I love chocolate. Chocolate! 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 chocolate. You vanilla! Vanilla. Chocolate. Chocolate. Vanilla. Vanilla. Chocolate. Vanilla. Vanilla. I choose vanilla. 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 Chocolate! <laughs> Today we have a new segment for you with hosts Evan and Max called Extreme Interview. With a name like that, I hope they're ready to entertain us. Hello, 
I am Key Strange here with the one, the only, Philly Fanatic. Now, I'm curious, as the name suggests, to know what <laughs> the Philly Fanatic does during the springtime. Well, during the springtime, I like to watch a good baseball game by the Phillies. Well, 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 well that's very in interesting. Now, you, you, know, you know what I like to do during the springtime? I like to just, you know, lounge around eating a nice banana every once in a while. Well, that's very nice, but that's not very active at all. See, the kids, to get active, you should ride a bike, go read a book, or shoot some baskets. Well, well that's very interesting. Thank you. And I bet that's what all, all, all the kids are doing these days. Right, kids? Yeah! Oh, well, that's very nice. Now, um, wh what do you like to do in your free time besides watching a um, baseball game? Well, I mean, I like to go play some baseball, or I like to ride my scooter around the neighborhood. Well, that's very, that, that's very interesting. Now, I will look into not eating bananas all the time and start, you know, shooting hoops, as you guys say it, or um, playing baseball. Yes. So, th thank you so much for your time today, Philly Fanatic. I had a great time. No problem. Wow, that was a pretty loud interview. You know, a couple weeks ago, we had Science Night here at the Square. Let's take a look at some moments from that night. This year's Science Night was a huge success. Over 100 students participated. The science projects ranged from water to electricity to chemistry and many more. Gwyneth Square would like to thank all the students for a wonderful night of science. Last up today is the final PSSA thoughts and tips. Why do you think they first made the PSSA? Well, the PSSA are designed to measure the student's performance in math, English language arts, and science. Do you have any tips for the first time takers of the PSSA? Well, our first, if it's the first time taking the PSSA, the first thing I do is relax. I want you to be in a relaxed, calm uh, type of, of uh, atmosphere and have a calm attitude towards the test. We don't want to stress you out and make you feel uncomfortable. Secondly, I want you to try your best. Try to read through each question. Look for answers that make sense. Look for answers that you can eliminate, but try your best. And finally, um, I want you to not feel any anxiety or feel upset about the test. I want you to get a good night's sleep each night, have a good breakfast the morning of the test, and come in with a good attitude. Thank uh, you for all your help. And yeah, thank you for the interview. As always, thanks for tuning in. We love bringing you the news and hope you love watching. We will send you off with some clips from our crazy town here at the square. See you next time. <laughs> Thank you.